My name is Melalupe Vacauta. I am a licensed electrician. I didn't start out to become an electrician. My father, he's an electrician, and so um, he decided to recruit me to follow in his footsteps. So I took a course to New Zealand, and I also did my certificate four in electrical technology in PNG. And at the moment, I am studying for my bachelor's in engineering at the University of the South Pacific. I think that women are still viewed as not an equal to a male in the industry um, because we're generally viewed as the weaker ones. I think with training, women can be equal to men, but um, in the workplace, if you know what you're doing, you can just do your job. I think you would have to be determined if that is what you really want to do, become an electrician. You just go through the steps, um, get your, your grades up, uh, go to Fokololo, or if you get a scholarship, go overseas um, and get some experience. Um, you just have to be really determined, work hard, you can be a bit intimidated by having a lot of men in the trades, but um, like I said before, if you really know what you're doing and that's what you really want to do, just go for it. As an electrician, the best part of the job is when you finish wiring a house and everything, when you turn it on, works safely, everything's working according to how you wired it. The challenges of being an electrician is you get the money when you, if you get a job. It's not like a steady income unless you're contracted by another company to, for maintenance. Um, I usually just do work for my friends and word by mouth spreads really fast and I get clients calling me. Um, I'd encourage people to please find a qualified electrician, not one on Facebook. Uh, <laughs> find the ones that are on the list at the Tonga Power Board office. <laughs> I probably wouldn't change anything because this is how I got to where I am by the choices I made while I was in high school but maybe I'd concentrate on my maths. <laughs> I did really poorly in maths in high school, but now um, maths is important. <laughs> if I could go back to being a child, I'd tell myself to study hard. Be determined, don't let anyone tell you to do anything else. If you wanna do something, go do it. You learn from your mistakes. <laughs> Well, she'd have to be God-fearing, humble, and honest. They need to be more vocal, um, not just be intimidated by men in power, but, for example, the youth parliament. I think that's a good start to, for future generations. <laughs>